Welcome to the UCC's COVID-19 weekly update for the week of June 24th. It's the end of the school year and we're very happy to see lots of Ukrainian Canadian graduates. This week in our uh, bulletin, we are featuring some online graduation uh, news from Edmonton and Montreal because uh, we know that teachers and students are celebrating their grads in interesting ways uh, given the health parameters. So congratulations to all of those teachers and graduates. Uh, Janine, can you tell us what's happening uh, in Winnipeg at Holy Family Nursing Home? Yeah, so the well-being campaign was started by the UCC Manitoba uh, project in partnership with the Lubov Foundation to purchase much needed equipment for the Holly Family Nursing Home in Winnipeg. This is a response to COVID-19 pandemic that has taken a huge toll on our uh, seniors. Uh, please read the full article below and to support this campaign, please visit their uh, website at www.ucc.mb.ca. Great, thank you. І Лесю, ми маємо проєкт в Україні допомогу дітей. Як люди можуть дістати більше інформації про це? Так, ми маємо нову інформацію від Ксені Зубрів про проєкт в Україні, про який ми вже згадували. Це є Help Us Help the Children разом з Канадською українською фундацією. Ксенія відвідала Житомир з гуманітарною допомогою. І ми маємо відео, де вона розказує, як проходить весь цей процес, як відбувається. І дуже гарне відео, просимо подивитися його. І, звичайно, знову заохочуємо вас підтримати цей важливий проєкт. Дякую, Ласю. Отис, in terms of uh, supports for businesses, what's new from the federal government? So we've got um, links to several programs that are being run by the federal government for small and medium businesses as well as for not-for-profits. Not for so check out the link to find, to find out about uh, loans, forgivable loan programs, uh, grant programs, uh, interest-free loans and other uh, supports for small businesses and medium-sized businesses. Great, thanks, Otis. And Mariana, it's hard to believe that next week is Canada Day already. So uh, we can't do the usual gatherings that we do for Canada Day, but uh, how can people find out about online celebrations in their community? Yeah, I can't believe it myself. So this, um, this year, Canada Day uh, celebrations are taking place virtually. And people can join numerous online activities from culinary challenges to sports to, you know, even socially dis distanced scavenger hunts and explore different facts about Canada with famous Canadians on July 1st. And also Canada Day will have um, two shows uh, during the day and in the evening featuring some talented artists from across the country, which will be streamed on CBC and Canadian Heritage social media platforms. So we include the links to festivities in our bulletin. Make sure to check it out. No fireworks this year, I guess. Maybe, yeah. maybe next year. Okay, well, we wish everybody well on this June 24th. Uh, hopefully the weather is nice and warm where you are, as it is where we are, and we'll uh, stay in touch throughout the summer. Again, if you have any interesting news or information to share, don't hesitate to reach out to us at nationaloffice at ucc.ca. We'd love to profile your summer events and summer programs, and we hope that you're healthy and safe. Thanks very much. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.